The Verify team exists to get you the facts by disproving misinformation. While we do our best to protect ourselves against the coronavirus, there's a phrase worth bringing up. Can you have too much of a good thing? In this case, let's talk about exercise. A lot of us are trying to stay active while stuck at home, knowing the benefits a healthy routine can have on our bodies, especially when it comes to fighting viruses. But could you be overdoing it? Well, let's verify. Does frequent regular exercise weaken your immune system? Our main sources are the CDC, the NIH, and a study from the Journal of Sport and Health Science. The CDC says adults should be getting at least 150 minutes of moderate physical activity every week, plus some muscle strengthening activities two days a week. Plenty of research also shows exercise can boost our body's immune system. According to a study from researcher David Neiman at Appalachian State University, moderate intensity physical activity can improve one's ability to fight viruses and reduces morbidity and mortality from viral infection and respiratory illnesses. But what about ramping up the intensity? Can that cause any damage and put your body at risk? Well, there's no conclusive data saying you might be doing more harm than good once you cross a certain training line. One study, for example, from the NIH argues that immunosuppression is less about overtraining and more about a combination of other factors like anxiety, diet, and sleep. So we can verify, no, regular exercise is not going to weaken your immune system and leave you vulnerable to COVID-19. Ultimately, steady exercise is going to do more good than bad. Just remember not to overdo it. And don't forget, if you have any questions you want us to verify, email our team of researchers and we'll get right on it. That's verify at WUSA9.com.